Good morning, team. Welcome back to the channel. Oh, it's Tuesday. Um, and I have a treat for you. Occipital neuralgia. Have you heard of this? I bet you felt it. I bet you've had this and you didn't know what it was. Have you ever had a pain that went over your head from the base of your neck, like the, the bottom of your cranium, up on top of your head, and then also a pain that goes around your ear. And it feels like somebody is shocking you or that it's like a precursor to a stroke. Have you ever felt that? I did. Well, full times last night. Like it just kept happening, kept happening, kept happening. And I was a little worried about it, but I'm so smart. I did some research, you know me, me and research. I found out that that is occipital neuralgia. So what is it? Well, really it's when your C2 and higher, there's a nerve right there and that nerve when there's inflammation around it, it causes that pain. And so you'll see, um, what are those people called? They're not masseuse massage therapy, but they like crack your bones. <laughs> um, chiropractor. Chiropractors are uh, very used to hearing about this. Massage therapists probably are used to hearing it about it too. And what they recommend is, of course, good posture. Um, and two, uh, you can actually put two tennis balls underneath your head, right on that spot and on either side. And it will help because it will massage it. The weight of your head will massage it um and yeah that's what that is so that shooting pain that you never knew that you, what it was um it's inflammation on your optic or occipital nerve that goes over your brain and around your ear and it's also it's also inflamed by lesions in your C2, C3 area, I happen to have a 13 millimeter lesion there. So, the more you know, kids. Uh, anything else? Well, the word thing and memory thing still, still is a thing. Uh, as you noticed, I danced all around the word chiropractor because it took me a while to remember what that was um, this morning. Um, doing my voicemail for work. I probably paused a good 10 seconds to remember that it was March. Because <laughs> every morning I say, thank you for calling. This is Laura Smith. You've reached my voicemail. Today is March. Or I said something. It is the 10th of, and I just pause, pause, pause. March. I had to go through literally every month in my mind to remember what month it was. So that's fun. <laughs> oh, and I got a magic bullet yesterday. I'm really big into smoothies and I made my very first soup. I made an asparagus soup with asparagus I had that I needed to use. Very impressed. Pretty good. All right, team, have a great day. Have a great Tuesday. Um, make it happen. <laughs> Be well, and we'll chat tomorrow.